So today we're learning how to play the Adams Family theme song. For me, this is one of the best theme song songs of all time. What are your favorite songs from sitcoms? It's actually kind of hard to say. It was a tongue twister. I had to do this a lot. Let me know in the comments below because I would love to teach them if I haven't. For me, this is top five. I would put Golden Girls in there too. The other three, I'm not quite sure. New ukulele Wednesday and Saturday, guitar on Monday. Subscribe if you like this kind of content so you never miss a lesson. Baritone the first Wednesday of the month. Printable tabs for every single tutorial by becoming a Patreon. I will also have the tabs on the screen. One-on-one -on -one lessons if you're interested. My email's in the description. Let's do it. Grab the ukulele, brain, snap, and attention span when you have those four things. Follow me on in and let's break it down. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the iconic intro and the snapping part. It sounds like this. Then it repeats. Well, the creepy and the kooky are so very spooky. Okay, and then you go into the singing. So the, it's a triplet, and then you land on the one, and the snaps are on the two and the three, which means the triplet starts on the four. So, first fret, second fret, do do, open A string, first fret of the A string. One, three, zero, one. Triple it one, and it's on the fourth beat, so we would count it four polo one, Two, three, snap, 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 snap. And you would do it that time, that way, just one time. Snap, snap. That's the second riff. Third fret of the E string. Open A again. But this time instead of B flat, B, second fret of the A string, to the third fret. So it's three. O oh, two three, three o oh, two three, and the rhythm's the same. It's a triple it one snap snap. Those two together, nice and slow. One, two, three, four polo one snap snap, four polo one snap snap. If you're having trouble um with the triplets, try this. One, two, three. Four, one, two, three, four. Strawberry, 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 triple it, triple it. Strawberry is three, um, three syllables. And if you can say those like on each downbeat, strawberry, 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 triple it, triple it, triple it, strawberry, strawberry, strawberry. Strawberry one, two, three, strawberry one two, three, strawberry, one. It will help you kind of get the hang of the timing. So put on a metronome or just tap your foot to the music. And when you tap, say strawberry, if you can't do the triplets. Next time through that do, 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 click, click. So we got that, right? Now, now comes the rundown where we're gonna do that two times in a row. And then the original one and then snap. So let's play through it nice and slow together. And we're gonna go one, two, three, doo -doo -doo. one, two, three, strawberry, one, two, three. Okay, I'm not gonna say strawberry, but in your brain, if you're struggling with the triplet timing, go ahead and do that. One, two, three, four. Again. Well, the creepy and the kooky, and now we're in the part that's spooky. Only three chords throughout the entire tune, B flat, third fret, second fret, first fret, first fret. If you absolutely just can't get this, but you love the song, try B major seven. Three, two, one, zero. It'll 
work as a substitute while you're learning this, but ultimately this song will sound better with this B flat. If also, if this feels a little too hard for you, you can do a bigger bar, but you're only playing these two strings, all right? Follow that by a C minor, open, three, three, three. If that's too hard, you can use three fingers, just like you would on your D chord. Then we have an F. If you were... In terms of strum, pretty simple, straightforward, down, down, up, over each chord. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, 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 up. I accidentally forgot an up in there and just did some two downs, but that's okay because that variation goes to show you that you can make some slight mistakes in, uh, entre comillas, but how would you say that? Um, in parentheses or in quotations? And it doesn't really matter. Like you can go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four, and. Feel free to kind of liberate yourself from that strum pattern a little bit. If that seems like a daunting task to you, I'll put a link to a video I did up here that talks about exactly that, liberating yourself from the strum pattern. Okay, so let's put the keywords up and we're gonna touch on some keywords. The melody essentially is a four measure idea that repeats itself two times. And it's, they're creepy. So you don't start on there, it's they're creepy and they're kooky, mysterious and spooky, all together kooky, the Adams family, all right? Family, that's where you come in on there. Adding the strum nice and slow. They're creepy and they're kooky, mysterious and spooky. All together ooky, the Adams family. Random solo. That was an Adams family solo. The next time through, their house is a museum where people come to see them. They really are a scream, the Adams family. And after playing through that again, we would go right back into the. Which serves as a bridge. And then we're into the coda last time strumming through. After going through the. Again, we're gonna play the chord progression the first time through normal. So get a witch's shot, a broomstick you can crawl on. We're gone. And then it changes here. The B flat and the C minor are normal. The F is gonna be a whole measure. So you're not gonna go F right back to B flat. You're gonna go F, one, two, three, four, B flat. And I do four downs on the F. One, two, three, four, B flat. So we get, so get a witch a shot, no broomstick you can crawl. We're gonna pay a call on the Adams family. I just threw that in there. I guess that's kind of up to you if you want to add that at the end. The Adams family. But in hindsight, that probably is a little better way to end it. The Adam's family. Finish right there. From the top. Here we go. One, two, three. They're creepy and they're kooky. Mysterious and spooky. They're all together ooky. The Adam's family.
everybody, you made it to the end. Great job. Now, whether you're a monster or a human, I like what you are doing. Jamming in the mansion, got the mommy dancing. The werewolf left the bite, but he also left the like. Catch you next Wednesday or Saturday for ukulele guitar on Monday. The first Wednesday of the month is Baritone Wednesday. Printable tabs for all the lessons by becoming a Patreon. It's cheaper than a cheap cheeseburger and it will accelerate your learning or cheaper than a cheap human burger if you are a monster that eats human like a like Dracula. Cheaper than a blood burger. Well actually I have no idea how much that costs but I'm assuming for Dracula it's relatively cheap. I will catch you then Monday for guitar. It's a beautiful day. I think I'm going to go out and Enjoy the day. Shout out. A quick shout out to longtime Patreon Daniel Cash. Scooby Dooby Doo, where are you? He taught me that one.